Hi, my name is Josh, and I just want to show you guys my cool phone and basically give you the application list that can do it. Uh, this is a Verizon Mobile uh, version 6.1 uh, running an iPhone theme and on a Samsung i910. So I got slide 2 unlock here, giving me my iPhone theme and my iPhone theme kind of menu here, which is a little bright, I guess. Uh, first thing I want to go over, the first thing I would do before doing anything that we have here is download the new ROM upgrade to unlock the GPS. Now remember it's going to wipe out your phone's uh, contacts programs. I got two links over in the sidebar to get to that uh, new ROM. Uh, another thing you'll need is WizBar Advanced Desktop which essentially makes all these buttons and everything happen here. And it makes it real finger friendly and you can actually slide well another thing you need is again over in that uh, sidebar and it gives you the iPhone theme which uses WizBar advanced desktop you can use a slide and you know it's sort of like the iPhone real finger friendly and we'll go back to the main menu here the slide to unlock is there uh, the eye contact this eye contact sort of gives you a iPhone type contact list can use that and you don't really need to use this pointer I'm just using it because it's easier than my fingers getting in the way to show all this and that's pretty much it there we also got Opera Mobile this is free utility uh, makes browsing the web a lot simpler I love this new newest version which is a beta the biggest problem with the beta is it doesn't have uh, the flash plug-in yet so uh, you won't be able to watch Hulu on your phone just yet but it is coming around real quick I'll open this up and it comes to this main menu I'm just gonna go to my favorites here and we'll just go to Google you know, again flash player isn't installed yet and uh, you know it means some stuff like uh, Groove Shark isn't going to work. I'll just do anything I can do here. And it's pretty responsive. Usually auto formats text within the column you're, or the window you're looking at. So that's pretty nice. Uh, the next thing is uh, Google Maps. Uh, like I said, that ROM upgrade actually unlocks the GPS in here so you can show your location not only to yourself, but you can show your location to friends on the web. That's my that's through latitude right there. Currently it's showing me in a cell phone tower, you know, within about uh let's see about 2,000 meters uh, when you actually go outside. I'm indoors right now. It picks up the GPS signals. Uh, just make sure that your GPS is enabled and not on emergency only. So that's pretty much it there. You can figure out the rest. Now continue sharing my location. Uh, another cool thing in here is Resco Fire File Explorer. Uh, let's just manage your files on your actual phone. And uh, close out of that. Uh, one thing I can't live without is a uh, pocket player. I listen to a lot of talk radio all day because I hate listening to myself. And I still got to register and buy this version. You can go to browse, go to web guide, and you got Shoutcast and you got Radio Time. I use Radio Time currently. It gives you basically a giant list of uh, online radio stations. You can search for local ones, you can search for shows, but it plays it online and uh, works out pretty good. And being that this has a built-in speaker, you can actually hear it. Now that isn't the only thing it does, it also plays the music on your actual player, but you know, it's pretty much a given. Uh, another cool browser, if I go over a couple of things here. 
The Skyfire does essentially the same thing as Opera does, just in a different way, so gives you a little bit of flexibility there. Uh, I won't go too much into it because it's a basic browser and it takes forever. Uh, another good thing here, if you like music, Pandora. Uh, I got a Pandora account, so you can basically stream Pandora directly in your phone and play it over whatever. The biggest problem is the buttons are really tiny and not really finger friendly whatsoever. Uh, we got another thing here, Skype. Skype is no longer available uh, by Skype itself, but it's still supported so you're going to have to email me for the actual application. Uh, it works out pretty decently. And there's all my contacts and let's say I wanted to... Yeah. And not everybody I know, like the two people I know, are offline right now, so, yeah. Another cool thing is Music ID. Basically, this allows you to identify mu music, just like in that commercial a couple of years ago. This is actually some downloaded torrent, and uh, we'll go ahead and test it out real quick. I guess the buttons aren't quite working. I got this playing off my computer here. Anyway, it shows Rolling Stones, the harder stone, so that's pretty good. Let's see if we can get out of here. That's a hackware, so, you know, it is what it is. Also got OneNote in there, but I can't remember how to download that thing. Uh, a couple little nerdy utilities here. We got a remote desktop. Let's see if this works for me today. And I can basically log into my server I have at home here. And I'm not going to do all that today. And then we have uh, internet connection sharing. I can actually use my Bluetooth in my computer to connect into my, uh, utilize the Verizon cell phone network for broadband and all that. And I'm not going to go into that, but it's pretty easy. Another cool thing is MS Voice Commander. Let's see if it works for me. And it's probably not going to work for me today. Call Joanna Heinrich. Call Joanna Heinrich at home, work, or mobile. Home. Home. And that's probably going to wake the baby. Another thing I got here, Center Programs, I haven't made an icon for this yet, it's Facebook. And it's pretty much Facebook, so, yeah. And the last thing I got is just a uh, hearkening back in, to that iPhone theme. You can actually get the weather just like uh, you would on the iPhone different locations there. And that pretty much concludes this uh, video. Thanks. Have a nice day.